So a big ass tub of the sugariest, sweetest pineapple on earth, and a tub of organic asparagus, Thai asparagus in a little biodegradable cornstarch packing container. Just a little handful of asparagus is a uh, half a day's wage, and the rest of the half a day's wage is this is about 80 baht. So that's uh, Thais here work about 10 hours a day, 150 baht if you're a uh, labourer. So you're working maybe four hours to get this, and uh, six hours to get this. Incredible, isn't it? And this mango here is a day's wage, and it's a locally grown mango, but it cost me about 180 baht. And the average construction worker down there is earning about 150 baht. So they have to work 10 hours a day just to afford one mango. So most of my viewers are based in the US, the national income in the US is around 47 US per year. In Australia, it's about 43,000 US dollars per year. So people in the US earn roughly 10% more money every day than Australians. Income in Thailand is around $4,000 a year US. Cambodia is around $650 a year US. Philippines is around $1,170 a year US. Malaysia is around $7,000 a year US. So. You know, we got the example today. The average income in Thailand is around ten dollars a day. The have a look over here. We got some construction down there. Those guys and girls they're working ten, twelve hours a day for five dollars a day. So the little packet of asparagus and the pineapple there. That's what you're working a whole ten hour day as a construction worker just to afford that. I think we've got it pretty freaking easy in the USA. And uh, I think we've got it really it's easy in the, in the Western world in general. And people have got it here easy in Thailand as well. I mean, if you're a rice worker or if you're going to work on the organic fruit farms here, it's a pretty cool occupation. Again, it's just about working in occupations you're passionate about that you enjoy, that you can do it all day and night, that you love doing. That's what I do personally. I've got out of the jobs I hated and got into the things I love to do. So when all your work is play, you'll never work another day. And you can stay in the lack mentality and and just be hating it and making up excuses why you can't live your dreams or whatever. Or you can be out there, you know, just doing it. And I'm watching some construction workers down there now and I'm thinking, well, I bet there's some guys down there and girls down there who just love what they do. How they just, they're really proud of the work they do. And I bet there's people down there who just count down the hours so they can get off work and, you know, get some alcohol or, you know, smoke their, their life away or whatever. So again, it's just about doing what you love to do and only do that. Do what you love, love what you do. Thanks for watching. This is how your Thai coconut should look. Nice and white inside. No formaldehyde, nothing dip, and 40 cents from the local tree here in beautiful Chanaburi, Thailand. Cheers. I can't say that this is healthy for you. That is a big... Can you believe there's a skunk, a skunk front yard? Look how gorgeous it is. <laughs> oh, skunky, skunky, skunky.